Festival. Last but not least this morning, we are talking about an exciting event that's coming to the city of McAllen. You're definitely not going to want to miss out on this. We are joined right now with Adan Garcia, who's the Chamber Ambassador for the McAllen Chamber of Commerce, and we are talking about Mexlan. Yes, Mexlan 2019 at the McAllen Convention Center, yeah. July 24th through the 28th. Yeah, it's going to be really exciting. So we had you on um, a few weeks ago, and we were kind of just introducing it to the public, letting everybody know what was going on, and of course, you know, here we've been running commercials and advertisements yes, for yes. it, getting everyone excited. Yes, Maxlon 2019, you've probably already heard about it. Mm -hmm. It is the five-day interactive arts and music festival celebrating the past, present, and future of Mexico's cultural influence on our world. Mm -hmm. Seems real big, but it's actually very simple. Bringing a lot of great artists, mm -hmm. chefs, musicians from Mexico, honoring our traditions, mm -hmm. but then also looking at looking forward to the future of all the young RGV Latinos and mm -hmm. people from all the country and bringing them here and having a big party, big celebration for five days. Yeah, it definitely sounds really exciting. And there is a lot already to kind of sign up and register with. Um, so tell us a little bit. I know there's already registrations going on for there's certain There's a lot things. of questions about Mexlon. Is it yeah. free? Are mm -hmm. they ticketed? The, the great thing is, is that Mexlon is for everyone, for mm -hmm. all families and friends. It, it's free for five days, free entry, seven great experiences every every day mm -hmm. whether it's the free calendar parade or the free artisan mercado where they're bringing 200 craftsmen where you can buy crafts from mexico or food yeah. um, there's just fireworks a free music stage with famous omar apollo those are all free but then we have premiere experiences yeah. about eight of those that are food festivals great shows like circo hermanos vasquez the number mm -hmm. one latino circus in the, in the world la galagata is going to be performing uh, there's just something every night um the the first night's the neon run which i'm wearing the shirt yeah. right now <laughs> the the bright yeah, colored shirt it, yeah. and we're gonna have a luminescence out there and just once again just a we already have a, i think over 600 runners wow so we're inviting everybody to come out every day and and p pick your w the way you want to experience maxon and yeah. come out for five days book a hotel and, and stay with us. Yeah, definitely. It sounds like a really exciting thing and it's the first of its kind here. So it's really exciting to kind of be a part of that inaugural event and really, you know, just be a part of the great experience. That's going to be fantastic. Yeah, it, it, it's something new, um, but it's something I think we need as a, a region yeah. to celebrate who we are, to be proud of who we are and finding there we are finding special people in each of these categories whether it's music a music curator that came in and brought down mm -hmm. this these great music every 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 day in the evening um, whether it's esports we have a big esports yeah. community down here and they're having a uh, 27 different tournaments with $500 cash wow. prize if you're a FIFA fan a Madden fan we'd love to have you out for <laughs> <Okay>. that <laughs> and so i mean there's just something really for everyone and lots of light lots of color mm -hmm. people are asking one thing they're asking is is it a daytime thing, a nighttime thing? Mm -hmm. Well, it's it's really all day, right? So yeah. we have a 10 a.m. the the artist in Mercado starts. The the performances by Galagetza, the performing arts center in the world class facility, mm -hmm. and then in the evening the sun sun comes down when it's not very hot, and we mm -hmm. have a big uh, calendar street parade, and the music starts, and the food festivals. Yeah. So If you're looking for that, all you have to do find our schedule at mexlan.com, mxlan.com, and you can see the schedule, ticket pricing and all of, all of that good stuff. It's so exciting. And that is, again, from July 24th through the 28th. So uh, it's going to be an amazing time. Definitely go on out. It's five days. There's literally something for everyone to go out and participate in. Something for everyone. And we just have to thank all of our great sponsors. Mm -hmm. uh, Shaw Eye Center is our title sponsor. They, they're putting on the calendar parade mm -hmm. that's free. Um, we have the city of McAllen, um, Semex, Bogus Ford, mm -hmm. uh, Shaw, um, UTRGV, Tewa Cambriante, don't want to miss anybody. Yeah, of course. Um, Texas Monthly is coming out. They're going to have a, a unique uh, forum about border discussion wow. on Wednesday. Um, and Stripes, Stripes and Tewa Cambriante, those are, those are all of our sponsors. And um, UTRGV is coming out, and they're going to have a great uh, activities for, for kids. But we just want to thank all of them because they're some of the sponsors that help make this happen and bring Definitely. it together. And one, we just want to invite everybody out. Um, there's there's a great concert uh, on Friday that I think everyone would like to enjoy. That's mm -hmm. the Unite Music Festival, okay. and we're bringing in Los Invasores, and it's a, it's a it's a twenty dollar ticket for everyone to yeah. experience. So, 
come on out, um, everything on mxlan.com. Definitely. And is there, I know that there's a ton of events and there's just five days full of so many things for people to go and participate in, but would you say that there was just maybe one event in itself that truly captures the essence of what Mexlan is to that yes. people could just say, you know what, if you can only make it to one day and one event, what should they go on to? I, I think uh, it's, it's about un our culture here in the mm -hmm. Rio Grande Valley. Like people ask, well, what's so great about the Rio Grande Valley? I think it's the our hospitality, the, our, our willingness to go out together, share times together, barbecues. Mm -hmm. yeah. And I think you're gonna really see that come to light at the calendar, the Shock Calendar Parade, which is really a street style parade from Oaxaca where people, um, the Gelaguetz performers, which are all coming, they're, they're world famous dancers, they're gonna come and dance in this parade. Mm -hmm. They pull people out of the crowd. There's giant puppets and, and giant balloons and just that, that evening sunset, right before sunset. And we're just, everyone's gonna incur live bands and encourage everyone to jump into this parade and dance together. Mm -hmm. And I think that's where you're gonna really feel that, that RGV regional vibe of energy yeah. and, and, and love for each other. And that I think is gonna be a cool piece that you have to experience. And that kicks off the night. Of so course. that kicks off and then the breakthrough stage music kicks off. You can still go in and see the artist in Mercado. You can mm -hmm. walk through the lights. You can go in to watch one of the shows if you want. But mm -hmm. I think that's really where we're going to come together and have a great time. Yeah, it sounds like there's just so much to do that it could almost seem, uh, you know, overwhelming. But that's what you guys have the website for and kind of pick and choose what you want to do. And in general, I think regardless if you just walk in and you said it's free, if you're just walking in for free and you just take in everything that there is, yeah. the atmosphere, it's going to be amazing it's free you can come in and we're gonna have a giant uh, there'll be a giant schedule with mm -hmm. a map just like a it's our it's our little theme park to yeah, experience perfect. some culture you can you can capture that and you can don't if you haven't been able to figure it out you can't buy tickets online right now you're not ready to mm -hmm. go in and come to the event you're gonna be able to buy tickets to all the experiences awesome. but just remember that the food festivals we mm -hmm. have three awesome food festivals um, one's uh, Sabor Mexico which is bringing in world-class chefs from Mexico 19 restaurants we have the Grill Masters, which is actually all the top grillers from Mexico coming in. Mm -hmm. And then we have the Catrinas, uh, Mezcal, Tequila, and Catrinas. If you, if you like to taste some tequila yeah. or mezcal, <laughs> which I think tequila, National Tequila Day is coming up. Yeah, it is. Those, those, all those you can purchase there. But remember that we only have 700 tickets mm -hmm. for those premier events. So if you're looking to get to eat to eat right and you're a foodie from the RGV, which I know we have a lot, mm -hmm. um, you probably want to purchase those in advance because yeah. they're, they're going pretty quickly. Of course. So definitely go ahead and visit their website. It's right there on your screen mxlan.com it's going to be really exciting 24th through the 28th am i right there that's 20, correct 24th, 24th through the 28th. 28th so it's really exciting make sure to go on out it's going to be at the mccallan convention center it's going to be just an amazing week of fantastic events for you to participate in um, i want to thank you so much for coming in today and chatting with us no problem i appreciate it um, new stuff going on every day yeah. so book book a hotel yeah we already have a bunch of people coming down uh, from different cities it's been pretty exciting one young lady's driving 17 hours to come see Whoa. the butcherettes so we have a lot of people coming down to recognize and hang out and party with us so let's put on a good show for them definitely